This is a Carnegie Institution for Science audio news release for Sunday, June 14, 2009, an advance in understanding cellulose synthesis. Cellulose is a fibrous molecule that gives shape to plant cells. It's also the world's largest reservoir of renewable hydrocarbons. But before scientists can modify it to make energy-efficient crops, they have to understand the processes that produce it. Scientists at the Carnegie Institution's Department of Plant Biology have studied the relationship between microtubules and the enzyme that produces cellulose fibers. Microtubules provide the scaffolding that allows cells to form with different shapes. The researchers engineered fluorescent versions of the molecules in the enzyme and the microtubules. They were thus able to track even single molecules. They discovered that the microtubules guide the enzymes as well as organize their delivery. Scientists also looked at a structural element called actin cytoskeleton. They found that it's needed for the general distribution of the cellulose-producing enzyme, but that microtubules are required for final positioning. The findings appear in the advanced online publication of the journal Nature Cell Biology for June 14th. For more information, see our website at www.ciw.edu. This is John Strom for the Carnegie Institution.